Hello again. My name is Johannes Greger and I'm manager of Advanced Test Systems in AVL. In our recent post, we have introduced examples of available AVL solutions in regard to test facilities for hydrogen internal combustion engine testing. In this video, we are going to continue showing you AVL solutions about the next important points in order to be ready for testing hydrogen internal combustion engines. Also, the exhaust analysis and particulate measuring systems for emissions measurement on hydrogen internal combustion engines need to be carefully checked on their suitability. Hi, Kurt. Hi. Ah. Nice to see you all here. I'm just preparing a measurement on a hydrogen engine. My name is Kurt Engelanger. I'm business development manager for emission testing system with a focus on application and regulation. Hydrogen measurement gives us a little bit of challenge because of the high water concentration in the exhaust that most emission components are very, very low. NOx emission might be high and so it's an issue of interference, uh, calculation and so on. However, we are prepared for it. We can do it very well. Like here, the emission bench where interferences, CLD analyzer and water is an issue. On the older system, we can upgrade it and all new Armour Slimline products are already prepared for hydrogen from the standard out. A core element is also the SESAM FDR from us, which can measure all the new components also in discussion what we need for Euro 7 and has no problem with the water. Everything is heated and measured wet. Particulate measurement in all forms is also a big issue for especially blended hydrogen fuels. So you need a particulate counter like the AVL APC. Here actually you see two devices of it, a micro suit sensor for the suit measurement and development and particulate mass if you do it with a CVS or an AVL smart sampler. All of these devices are all so ready for hydrogen. And AVL contributes very actively to the regulation parties. So myself is part of the hydrogen group for the UN ECE, Regulation 94 development or for off-road engines, the ISO forum, and my colleague Frank Berghoff is contributing to the US legislation with proposing formulas. Finally, AVL is very well prepared for emission testing on hydrogen and hydrogen blended fuels, and you are very well prepared with AVL equipment and solutions. Explosion protection being part of the overall Safety concept is key for the operation of test facilities for hydrogen internal combustion engines. A suitably designed test cell ventilation, exhaust extraction and ATEX compliant equipment fitting to the technical specification of the hydrogen internal combustion engines are important points to consider. Accurate and fast responding hydrogen pressure and flow monitorings, shutoff valves in the hydrogen supply line, as well as tailored safety routines in the test cell automation are the preconditions for the hydrogen test facilities safe operation. Having defined all safety related aspects and functions, it is finally important to embed these into the test facilities control and safety matrix on test cell and test facility level. AVIL is ready to share the existing expertise and to apply it at your test facilities which you would like to get ready for hydrogen internal combustion engine testing.